town of Brighton has 26 acres of new open space thanks to a recent purchase. Christian Garzon spoke with the town supervisor today about plans for that land and the cost to the community. 26.3 acres of land on Westfall Road in Brighton, acquired from the Faith Temple Church. Brighton Town Supervisor William Maley joined us for a wind-filled walk and discussed the community's plans for the real estate. All a part of the Envision Brighton 2028 plan, this area is viewed as a public resource that will, quote, balance ecological sustainability with a diversity of healthy recreational opportunities. With this new additional land, we're going to look at, you know, make some decisions about how we want to use it, but we're not going to rush into anything. The land will be combined with existing acreage here at Buckland Park, making it the largest park in Brighton, giving it over 147 acres of active and passive recreation land. Once merged together, the overall scope of the giant park will have ball fields, trails, lodges, the historic Buckland House, and wildlife habitats. For the newly bought land, there have been possibilities brought up, including a new community center and recreational outlets, but keeping it green is a priority. People are excited. They see deer, they see fox, they see all kinds of animals. So preserving that habitat uh, is important. And the cost of all this to the average town taxpayer? Less than a latte, or roughly $5 per year over the anticipated 20-year life of the bond. The town itself paid about $1.2 million for the land, but for Maley, land like this is priceless. One of the reasons we thought it was so important to buy this land is because they're not making any more of it. Whatever plan takes place, the town says this new land will increase the lasting environmental and community value for residents and visitors. Christian Garzon, News 8.